Jeremiah 32 and verse 27. Let's use that to open up the meeting. Then we start praying and men from now. I read Jeremiah 32, 27. It says, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? And he left a question mark behind it. It's a question that he wants us to answer. Hallelujah. I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Which means there is nothing that has to do with humans that there is any other God ab above me. We could sing, Koto ni shepe lue rara, eni yon ele rara, ti olonu mi wa tutu jue mi olonu lo. That's it. Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything to add uh, for me? Let me share two testimonies with you before we begin to pray. You know, I remembered the first testimony when I woke up very early this morning around, I think I woke up first around four. You know, and I was just meditating on the bed. The first testimony I, I remembered was one of our members, they relocated to Ghana many years ago. You know, that couple joined our church and um, they were believing God for a child. You know, that time, I still had enough time, not like now, that I didn't have time like those days. So I had to tell that woman that I will be praying with her every Wednesday. So every Wednesday, this woman will come to the church to meet me. We are at Adeniji then. We come to the church to meet me and we will be praying. At times, two hours, depending on the leading of the Spirit. At times, three hours. I was praying with her every day, every Wednesday. So one Wednesday, after we prayed, she went home. I was tired. I was trying to refresh myself with uh, um, bottled water. Now, while I was taking my bottled water, she ran back again, and I was shocked. Ah, madam, what happened? Why are you here? He says, sir, I have seen a wonder. I said, what is it? He says, as I got back home, I met my, my, brother, uh, my brother's younger brother. He came all the way from Ghana, and I met him at home. And as I got into the house, I quickly knelt down. I greeted him. I, got, I went to the kitchen to get uh, cold water for him. I asked him if he had not eaten. He said he has taken something. He said, but as he was taking the cold water, he was just looking at me with surprise. He was surprised. He said, and all of a sudden he said, ah, ah, you are not who they say you are. He now said, she now said, she wondered what happened. He said, ah, mama came to Ghana and said that her brother, uh, 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 his brother, married a wicked woman, a Nigerian woman, a Yoruba woman that is bad. So, madam, we went to lock your womb in a herbalist place. That, can I tell you this truth? Mama is the reason why you have not been able to have a child all these years of your marriage. He said, I only came to see you so that we can finish our work. He said, but I was surprised. As I came in here, you, enter, you, you received me so well, you entertained me and I was shocked. Madam, he said, he said, he said auntie, he said, sir, 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 uh, sir. Instantly, she said, she was just, she was afraid. She said, sir. He said, do you have 15,000 with you? He said, why? He said, I need to go and destroy the charm that mama did. But I don't have money to go back to Ghana and to do some runs of expenses. So the woman came, sir, should I give him money? Uh -uh. I said, what we have been praying for every Wednesday for how many weeks? Somebody walked in to show you a revelation and you are saying, go back and give him the money. So he, she went back home, gave the young man the 15,000. The next day morning, the man left. A week after he came back, he said, madam, you'll be pregnant. Do you know that it was that same month that she became pregnant? Now, when we say the Lord God of all flesh, is there anything too hard for him to do? There is nothing. The, the thing is just that most of us, when we finish praying, we don't exhibit the principles that will make our prayers to be answered. It is clearly stated in the word of God that when you pray and believe that your prayers are answered, in, that is when your prayers will be answered. Your prayers are not answered when you are praying. No. Your prayers become answered when you begin to believe that when you believe that your prayers are answered, the Bible says that is when your prayers will be answered. Do you know that she became pregnant that month, never had any issue with her pregnancy 
until she delivered in nine months' time. She delivered a bouncing baby boy. I won't forget. And uh, we took, we received the boy. I named that child. And uh, it was a testimony. Now, lo and behold, mama came again. And mama started telling them, we have to return to Ghana. We are not Nigerians. We have to return to Ghana. We are not Nigerians. We, are not, we have to return to Ghana. We are not Nigerians. And this sister didn't have power to convince her husband. So both of them traveled to Ghana. Only for me to hear two years after that both of them are dead. Now, what should be our second lesson? You know, the first lesson is to show you how powerful God is. The second lesson is to show you also that as a child of God, you must recognize your place per season with God. Where does God want me to be part time? Very, very important. Now, you don't, your location thing should not be determined by condition. It should be determined by the voice of God. Did you hear me? Now, because wherever the, the will of God does not take you, his grace does not sustain you. Now, when I heard it, I wept. It pained me. I felt bad. But there was nothing I could do. I was just thinking this morning that, ah, I don't know, if I meet that boy, will I be able to even recognize him? I, he, I, I, the time I left him, it was, the left was two years when he left. But understand this fact. If you are in the will of God, there is nothing your God cannot do. God will hearken to your voices. He will put the enemy to shame concerning you. See after me, he will put the enemy to shame concerning me in the name of Jesus. Now let's look at the covenant scriptures we are going to use to pray. We are taking 12. So believing that we have 12 prayer points this morning. Now those of you at, at the media, I want us to work together as we look at the first one. Psalm 44 and verse 3. Psalm 44 and verse 3. Let, let's take the Jews in that scripture as we are going to pray fervently. Psalm 44 and verse 3. Maybe I should run through it because of those at the media. Write that this one down. The next one is Psalm 90 verse 17. We have Isaiah 65 and 11. We have Psalm 84 verse 7. We have 2 Peter chapter 3, 15 and 16. It's not for you. I'm quoting it for the media people to write it down. We have Psalm 45 verse 2. We have Isaiah 14 verse 5. We have Ezekiel 21, 27. We have Jeremiah 5, 51, 53. We have uh, Je Genesis 49, 25. We have, uh, that's number 11 now, Genesis 27 and 4 Samuel 3, 18 to 22. There we'll be praying for restoration. Then the last one we have, the covenant scripture that he gave us for the month, 2 Samuel 22, 37. Now let's look at Isaiah 44. But, uh, sorry, Psalm 44 and verse 3. It says, For they got not the land in possession, in possession by their own sword. They didn't get it by their sword. Neither did their own arm save them. They didn't get it by the works of their hands. But, their, but thy right hand and thy arm and the light of thy countenance, because thou hadst had a favor unto them. Can you see? They did not get the land in possession that God promised them by their own sword. It's not that they fought to got it. You know, I know so many of us have strong spirit, fighting spirit. You say, I have the never say die spirit. I don't give up easily. The Bible is saying they, the, the promise of God did not come to pass in their life because they could fight. It says neither was their arm able to save them. It's not by the, any special thing they did that made them to get the promise of God. He said, but thy right hand. We are going to call on the right hand of God. Or what? On Lord. We are going to call upon. He said, thy right hand, thy arm, and thy light, and the light of thy countenance. Because thou art shown favor unto them. That's what it means. Your right hand has brought the manifestation of your promises to them. Now rise up on your feet. The first word you are going to declare, you say, oh Lord, say after me, oh God, let your right hand bring to manifestation 
your glorious promises for my life in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Let's begin to pray right now. Let your might, your right hand, O oh God, bring to manifestation the glorious promises that you have for me. Oluwa, I want eleriti any for me. Are you talking to the Lord? Please increase my volume a bit. Rekada basata yangada. Your right hand, O God. Your right hand, O God. Your right hand, O God. In the name of Jesus. Rabasata yangada. Legedebos. Lord, let your right hand, O God, bring to manifestation. Lord, your glorious promises for my life. Begin to pray. Rekada ba. O what? O Lord, O ya beresini cha for me. O what? O Lord, O beresini lana for me. Your right hand, begin, O God. Rakada basada. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Now look up. Let me tell you something about the right hand of God. In Isaiah 41, verse 10, if you are not and that God will not be dismayed, and we do for I will help you with my right hand of righteousness. Anytime God stretch forth his right hand, is to stretch for the hand of help. Let me see your hand in my life, O oh God. Let me see your hand, your right hand in every aspect of my life. This season, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Shall we turn into prayers? Let's begin to pray. My Father, my God, let me see your right hand of righteousness working in my life, oh God. This season, in the name of Jesus. Are you talking to the Lord? Rekada basede. Basata yagada. Rengada baskene. Let your right hand, oh God, begin to work in my life. In the name of Jesus. Let me see your right hand in my situation, oh God. Begin to pray for yourself. Lagada bas and delibos. Rekada baskende. Shagada basata yada. Basata yangada ba. Rengedibos. Lord, stretch forth your right hand towards me, oh God. Father, stretch forth your right hand towards my condition oh god in the name of jesus begin to pray let me see your right hand at work in my life oh god thank you father in jesus name we are praying we are still under that one prayer point you are going to pray what my eye have tried my hands did not reach let your right hand bring them to me. Oh, Lord, we go to Moti Le Le Le, to Moti Laka Kali. Lord, it's your word, me or me. Oh, Lord, it's your word. So we go do she she for me. So we begin to pray, begin to pray it in the name of Jesus. Let your right hand make it possible, God, for me in the name of Jesus. All the efforts I have, ex- I, I I have put to work. That has not produced anything. Le kada basi, re kada bara, shakada basi. Checking Rio, wore u baba. Muni checking Rio, wore u baba. Le kada basi ne, le kada bos. Muni checking Rio, wore u baba. Muni checking Rio, wore u baba. Le kada basi, le kada se. I want to roll wore u, I want you bada. I want to worry, worry. He said, I want you, Father. Baba, check in Rio. Worry, oh, Baba. Let me see your right hand, oh God. Let me see your right hand, oh God. Lord, at work in my life, in my affairs, in the name of Jesus. Ah, oh, what for, Lord? Oh, yeah, but it's near me. But it's near me. But it's near me. She can't. In the name of Jesus. Rakada basi. Basoto yengede. Yakada basanda yadabaskene. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name. We are praying. In Psalm 90 verse 17. Please sharp sharp. Psalm 90 verse 17. He said let the beauty of the Lord our God. Be upon us. And establish that the work of our hands. Upon us. Yea. The works of our hands. Establish that with. You know what we are going. The beauty of the Lord. Every power that wants to remove, remove the beauty of God from my life. You are destroyed now. In the name of Jesus. Shall we begin to pray? Begin to pray in the name of Jesus. Every power that wants to remove from my life the beauty of God. You are destroyed by fire. Begin to destroy them by fire now. In the name of Jesus. Rekadabase. Anigbo Bagbara. Tofe muwe wa olonu kuro ni nwa ye me. In olonu. Fire! In the name of Jesus. Begin to pray. Let the fire of God destroy them now. Rekadabase. Rekudiadaba. 
Basata yagada basi lengo di arabaski ne. Are you praying? 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 Are you talking to the Lord? Every power that wants to remove the beauty of the Lord from my life, you are destroyed now. You are destroyed now. You are destroyed now. You are destroyed now. In the name of Jesus. Rika da baba basanda yagada rege 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 des la gada ba o yagba duwa e wa olorun ni sonu ninu aye mi e wa olorun ni sonu la guara mi e wa olorun ni sonu ninu ise mi e wa olorun ni sonu ninu idile mi e wa olorun ni sonu la guara mi in the name of Jesus are you praying for yourself are you praying for yourself the beauty of the lord shall not be lost in my life the beauty of the lord shall not be lost from my body in my body it shall not be stolen rekada baba se ranga yaraba basata yagada baske shangada baraba rekede gede basata yangada ba legede gede are you praying 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 are you talking to the lord base ke le baske rekede gede lagada baskanda yara thank you father in jesus mighty name we pray now you now pray it like this father let your beauty you know what it means for the beauty of god to be seen in your life people look at you they see good things that will make them to say ah ah all of my dad are saying god is good to you let's pray it according to the scriptures and the, and and let the beauty of the lord our god be, you say oh lord let your beauty begin to show forth in my life from today in the name of jesus shall we begin to pray in the name of jesus let your beauty begin to show forth in my life in the name of Jesus in my family in the name of Jesus in my ministry in the name of Jesus beauty of the Lord beauty of the Lord are you praying are you praying beauty of the Lord begin to show forth in my life beauty of the lord begin to show forth in my life in the name of jesus lekada baraba baseke le baskene ringu di araba shangada baraba basata yangada bas legede gede gede raka ya rabaskene yes lord yes lord yes lord yes lord yes lord yes lord in jesus mighty name we are praying Take number three, Isaiah 60, 60, verse 5 and verse 11. I've given you all the scriptures so you, are, you don't need to be late. Isaiah 60, verse 5 and verse 11. Thank you. He said, Then thou shalt see and flow together, and thy heart shall fear and be enlarged, because the abundance of the sea shall be converted unto thee. Amen. Now look at where we are going. For the forces of the Gentiles shall come unto thee. Amen. Show me verse 11. The forces of the Gentiles shall come to thee. Now, therefore, thy gates shall be open continually. They shall, amen. They shall not be shut day or night. Amen. That men may bring unto thee, what? The forces of the Gentiles. And that their kings may be brought. You are going to pray. Gates of my life open. Let men and women from far and near begin to come with blessing to, to me. Begin to come with opportunities to me. Let men and... Listen. Listen, look up. There are gates in our lives. So We have gates in our lives. You have to command those gates to be open. Have you not seen... Somebody was telling me some years ago. He said, he just called me one day. He said, Pastor, are you in there at, at home? I said, I'm at home. He said, sir, I have been carrying some amount of money for, for so long. I want to come and give you something somehow we just prevent it. The Ote Kwesa. Something somehow. I shall, he's not a member of our church. Something somehow. He said, but now I've come to juggle. And I just remember again. That money is with me. Where are you, sir? I said, I'm at home. He now told me by himself. He's not a pastor. He said, sir, Emma, pray. Ote Kwesa. Do you know that the same thing happened? In the life of Daniel, the Bible says 21 days after his answer has been released from heaven, a demon, they, they call the name of the demon, the prince of Persia, stopped the angel that was sent by God to Daniel. The angel himself said, 21 days ago, 
God has sent me to you, but I was withheld by the Prince of Persia. And I've been there for 21 days until Archangel Michael came to rescue me. That's, I've come to give you the message. You are going to pray. Say after me, gates of my life. Be open. Night and day. For men, women, to come from far and near with opportunities for me. In the name of Jesus, shall we be praying? Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Gates of my life, come on. I command you, open in the name of Jesus. Command the gates to open. I command you, gates to open. For men and women to come from far and near. Yakada base with opportunities for me, with opportunities for me, with opportunities for me. Regada baraba, ringo di arabase. Are you praying? Are you praying? I command the gates of my family open in the name of Jesus for men and women to come from far and near with opportunities for me in the name of Jesus. Gates of my family open in the name of Jesus. Gates of my ministry open in the name of Jesus. Day and night for men to come with opportunities for me in the name of Jesus are you praying 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 are you praying, are you praying? Are you praying? Are you praying? Are you praying? Lengo de Arabas, Bassa da Yagada, Lenge de Gedes, Lenge de Gedesene, open in the name of Jesus, 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 Bassa da Yagada Gada. Are you talking to the Lord? Are you talking to the Lord? Are you talking to the Lord? Regada Barabas, Shangada Baraba, Rengo de Arabas, Basseke de Boskene, Balagada Barabaraba, Renge de Gedes. Open in the name of Jesus. 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 Are you praying? Are you talking to the Lord? Basata Yagada Baske. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Psalm 84, verse 7. That's the next one. Bala Basse Nelebos. Shagada Basse. Lingada Bas. Psalm 84, verse 7. Thank you. 84 7, not one. 84 7. Mm. They go from strength to strength. Every one of them in Zion appearing before the Lord. You are going to channel this prophecy to your health. Every attack on my health. See, after every attack on my health, begin to fail now. Arrows sent towards my health. Go back to your sender. I shall grow from strength to strength. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Begin to pray. Every attack on my health. Hear ye the voice of the Lord. Fail in the name of Jesus. Arrows of sickness and disease sent towards my direction. Go back to your center now. Go back to your center now. Go back to your center now. Are you praying? I shall grow from strength to strength. I will not be weak. I will not be weak. I go from strength to strength. 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 Balege de Bose. Are you praying for yourself? I will not be sick. I will not be sick. I will not carry a disease. My body system shall function well. My body system shall function well. Rege de Bose. Sakadaba. Lenge de Sene. Rangaira. My body system shall function well. In the name of Jesus. Are you praying? Begin to pray. I go from strength to strength. That's what the word of the Lord says. I go from strength to strength. I will not be weak. I will not be weary in the name of Jesus. Sagada Badabas. In. Jesus, mighty name of prayer. Number six is in Isaiah 45, verse 2. I and my wife use this one to pray. When I saw it, when we got to on Friday, I told her, Before you sleep, we have prayer to pray. Please follow this very well. Isaiah 45, verse 2. I will go before thee and make the crooked place. Okay. I'm coming. Hold on. We'll pray this one, but that's not the scripture, but we'll pray it. I, I, I will go, uh, sorry, I will go before thee 
and make the crooked places straight. I will break in pieces the gates of brass and cut in asunder the bars of iron. Now this is a divine promise to remove every obstacle from your way. Why have you not gotten to the place of your dreams? Why? You know, anytime uh, I and my wife were discussing that we want to play on some of our people's case, you know what I used to say? That, ah, okay, we'll play it. It's Psalm 45 2 that I'm talking about, not Isaiah, but leave this one. Let's play this one first. There's one of us that we have, we've been praying for. I used to tell my wife, I used to pick it from Tokyo Labi song. They put a lot of obstacles on their way. Show me that scripture. Let's pray that Isaiah. See after me, say, Oh Lord, go before me. Make my way straight. Break in pieces every gate of brass and cut asunder every iron hindering my progress in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Begin to pray. My father, Lord, I pray. Go before me in the name of Jesus. Make my way straight in the name of Jesus. Lord, break in pieces the gates of brass. Cut asunder the iron bars hindering my progress in the name of Jesus. Are you praying for yourself? Rege de ge de ge des. Basoto yenga da ba. Shaka da ba. Rengo di arabaske de. Basata yaga da ba. Father, break the eye. The the iron gates are sundered. Break into pieces the gates of brass. Everything standing to hinder me from going to the next point, from going forward. Lord, remove them. Lord, remove them. Lord, remove them. Shagada barabas, basa dayara, basa kele baskele, ringe de gede se, leka da baraba. Are you praying for yourself? 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 Leka da baraba, break every gates asunder, O God. Remove the iron, Lord. Every iron of Lord on my way. Every limitation on my way every hindrance on my way father remove them lord remove them lord remove them lord remove them begin to pray begin to pray reke de ge de ge des basa ta ya gada baske shagada bara bara ba basa ke ne baske ne re rengo di ara bara bas shagada baske Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Uh -huh. Let's now go to that one. Psalm 45, 2. Look at it. I had to tell my wife, we prayed this one together. Look at this. Thou art fairer than the children of men. Grace is poured into thy lips. A fury of it. Sorry, And what is the outcome? Therefore, God has blessed thee forever. When grace is poured upon your lips, sir, anything you say shall open doors for you. They get to a place of interview. They ask them questions. They answer the wrong thing. You say, pour grace upon my lips. Let, let me excel by the word of my mouth. You know what they call Grace. <laughs> It's like they put favor upon you. Anything you speak, people just like you. Esca, Esa, I took my time to find out. Who composed only? I won't compose me. Who composed, but there's grace upon his lips. When I look at some people too that are reading now, you see grace. If you listen to Lao, Lao, Lao Lu Benjo, that man that used to, is it Benjo they call his name? He does not have singing voice. But there is grace upon his lips. Pour grace upon my lips, O oh God. And let me excel 
by the words of my mouth shall we begin to declare in the name of Jesus my father my God pour grace upon my lips oh God and let me excel by the words of my mouth oh God by the words of my mouth oh God are you talking to the Lord are you talking to the Lord are you talking to the Lord? 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 Pour grace, pour grace, pour grace upon my lips. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Isaiah 14 and verse 5. We are going to decree every rod of the wicked. Isaiah 14 and verse 5. Let it be destroyed now. Who are for to he said the Lord had broken the staff of the wicked and the scepter of the rulers. Now, staff means is a is his power. That's why they say they give him the staff of office. If anybody enters the Senate house and carries the staff of authority, the senators will not be able to sit down again. Anything they sit down to do, if that staff is not there, it's not valid under Nigerian constitution. That's why when they were to they were to bury Queen Elizabeth, they put the staff of power. And it got to a point, the priest starts to say, now let every symbol of power be removed as we'll be laying down the remains of our sister. We are going to pray. Every staff, the wicked, used to rule my life. Let it be broken and destroyed. In the name of Jesus, shall we begin to pray? Let's begin to pray. Let the staff of the wicked be broken broken in the name of Jesus. Every staff that the wicked is using to, in, to, to, to intrude my life be destroyed by fire. Be destroyed by fire. Be destroyed by fire. Hey, I got a barabas. Shangada barabas. Ringe de ge de ge des. Basoto yenga da barabas. Are you praying? Be destroyed by fire. Every staff that the wicked is using to intrude my life. Be destroyed by fire now. By fire now. By fire now. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. They also use staff to direct. You are going to pray. My life will not follow the order of the wicked. Hear me. You are going to pray. There's what we call evil pattern. My life will not follow after evil pattern. You know when this prayer became so real to me? It was one day. This year. My wife said I should sit down. She wants to talk with me. What is it? I won't tell you what she said. But listen, he said, My mommy, my own mother of blessed memory, called her and told her, Yeah, me see, he said, Sir, Ma, yeah, me see, take care of Pastor very well. She said, She didn't know that my mommy would die. They used to talk so well on phone. His father was a very good man, very, very good man. And I see that Pastor, too, your husband, because my mom used to call me Pastor, he's a very, very good man. He said, His father, too, very good man. I suppose not to leave him. He said, see, but the people that surround him, he's so loyal to the point that people, everybody will just be directing his life. Man, you keep pastor rebel. Yeah, me see? Man, you keep pastor rebel, Joe. And sincerely speaking, my life was gradually looking like that of my father. There are people around me. And I started praying. You are going to pray for yourself. My life will not follow after evil pattern in the name of Jesus. I will not be like my father. Or do you want to be like your father? I will not be like my mother. I will be better off. Every staff, the wicked is used, trying to use to direct my life to follow evil pattern. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. My life will not follow after evil pattern in the name of Jesus. Every staff 
that the wicked is trying to use to direct my life to follow evil pattern you are destroyed you are broken in the name of Jesus are you praying for yourself pray ah, pray pray I will not be like my father Lord I shall be better than my father I will not be like my mother Lord I shall be better off in the name of Jesus begin to pray regada bara bara bas balenge de gede gedes basoto yenga daba shagada bara ba balenge de gedes basata yagada bara ba are you praying 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 break that stuff a a kilo de igbe aye e se wa fi mama jo ti ye e bai so fun olorun oluwa mo ko Ah, you know, I reject it. My life will not be like that of my father. It shall not be like my mother, oh God. I shall be better off. I cut off from that evil pattern. I cut off from that evil pattern now. Shagadabara, are you praying? I cut off from that evil pattern. Bayegedebo sadayara. Rengedegedegedes. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. I love this next one. Ezekiel 21, 27. Ah, you will pray, O oh Lord, overturn things in my favor. Overturn things in my favor. Show me. Look at the scripture. It says, and I will overturn. Overturn. Overturn it. And it shall be no more until he come whose right it is and I will give it him can you see that I will keep, until he gets to him I will keep turning it let them try to hold it I will turn it until it gets to him where, where am I whose right it is let's hold on this scripture they, sh they should not be sitting on what belongs to you and they are still there making jets of you. Because sin to say, there's nothing you can do. I will overturn. Overturn. Overturn it. And it shall be no more. Until he come. Whose right it is. And I will give it to him. Say after me. Oh God. Overturn things. In my favor. Until he gets to me. In the name of Jesus. Shall we begin to pray? Begin to pray. Rakada base. Lord of our in my favor, oh God, until it gets to me. Are you praying for yourself? But you are right in the name of Jesus, Lord of our tongue, Lord of our tongue, overturn things, oh God, in my favor, 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 in my favor. Overturn it in my favor, Lord. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name of prayer. Jeremiah 51, 53. After it, we have three more and we close. Jeremiah 51, 53. You want to bring down every Babylon. What does Babylon signify? Everyone using evil power to oppress your life. You bring them down. Where are you now? Where are you? Where are you? Jeremiah 51 and verse 53. He said, he said, set up a standard in the land. Though Babylon should mount up to heaven, and though she should fortify the height of her strength, yet from me shall spoilers come unto her, said the Lord. I want spoilers to my, to my finish. You are going to say after me, everyone using evil power to mis disorganize my life. Everyone using evil power to disorganize my life. Spoilers from the Lord. Visit them now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. But go out on the guard IP. Ah ah. Latifa. Latifa. Shiaye. Latifa. Bayo. I call for spoilers. But if you want spoiler, Latio, bring them down. In the name of Jesus, sir. Reggae de Bose, 
Shagada Baskene, Rakayara, spoilers from the throne of God begin to bring down everyone using evil powers to hinder my life, to hinder my progress. Ah, Yagada Barabas, spoilers from the throne of grace. Visit them now in the name of Jesus. Lagada Barabas. Shagada Barabas. Legedegedes. Basata Yagadas. Legedegedesede. Basata Yagadabase. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. Genesis 49 and verse 25. Legada Base. Put it on screen. Basata Yagadabase. Genesis 49 25 Even by the God of thy father who shall help thee and by the almighty who shall bless thee with the blessings of heaven above the blessings of the deep the light under blessings of the breast and of the womb you will claim all these blessings you see after Lord, say after me say oh God help me bless me with the blessings of the heavens Bless me with the blessings of the deep. Bless me with the blessings of the breast. Bless me with the blessings of the womb. Lift up your voice and begin to prophesy. Begin to prophesy. Begin to prophesy in the name of Jesus. Father, help me. You are my helper, O oh God. Help me, O oh God. You are the Almighty, O oh God. Bless me, O oh God, with the blessings of the heavens above. With the blessings of the earth beneath, with the blessings of the breast, with the blessings of the womb, in the name of Jesus. Are you praying? Are you praying? This is the blessing of, I of Isaac upon Jacob. Begin to claim it for yourself. Basata yanga da baskene, shagada baskana yara, reka da bara bara, ringe degeres. Basata ya, oluwa bokofome, oluwa ramilo wo. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Number eleven. This time we want to pray the prayer of restoration. Ungo kutu baso nubo dokada, akuku tu so nubo dokada. And Fanito son of God of Father. Genesis 20, verse 7. Then we also read under the same 1 Samuel 30, 18 to 22. Now, therefore, restore the man, his wife, for he's a prophet, and he shall pray for thee, and thou shalt live. And if thou restore her not, know that thou shalt surely die. Thou and all that are dying. Oluwa, gbogbo awon to joko le, o to je ti mi, Oluwa be ile won wo bayi. Oluwa se kini be ile won gbo. Ki won le jowo eto mi fun mi. Now, look at for Samuel 30 18 to 22. And David did what? Recovered all. Say Prince we will recover all. Ah, say Prince we will recover all. See after everyone sitting upon my entitlement sitting upon my opportunity sitting upon my right father visit their house with your judgment that will make them release what belongs to me i shall recover all up here madam begin to pray begin to pray i shall recover all i shall recover all i shall recover all I shall recover all. Lege de sene, lege de bose, la gaiara base, lege de bose. Yenga na bara 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 bas, sege de s, lege de bose, shagada ba, reke de gede s, basanda yara baske. Thank you, Lord. 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 
in Jesus mighty name of prayer the covenant scripture that God gave us when we finished praying and fasting on Wednesday 2 Samuel 22 37 oh God enlarge my steps thou hast what enlarged my steps under me so that my feet did not sleep and I told us on Wednesday an enlargement of step what does it mean you take one step and you get results of 200 steps your step is enlarged your one step is like 200 steps God gave us this covenant after we finished fasting and praying on Wednesday and I told us we are sowing that seed tomorrow that we should sow seed of enlargement of steps in three categories whatever one that you have capacity to do I told us we can sow a seed of five thousand we can sow a seed of what's the second one again two thousand what's the third one one thousand just bring it to the altar and say Lord please enlarge my steps let every step and don't bring it before tomorrow I said bring it to church on tomorrow you know I'll be anointing you in the service tomorrow then after I, the anointing service you come to the altar lay down and say Lord please enlarge my steps let my one step produce mega results for me so let's call that scripture to manifestation say after me oh God enlarge my steps on every side in the name of Jesus shall we begin to declare uh, that's the last one for this morning enlarge my steps on every side oh God Legada Badabase Sangada Badabadabas Basanda Yarabadabas Basata Gagada Skinele Seke Shagada Baskini Lingada Basanda Raga Yarabadabas Basata Yagada Baskini Raga Yarabaskini Begin to thank the Lord for answer to prayers Begin to thank the Lord for answer to prayers Begin to thank the Lord for answer to prayers. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. Ebenezer, Ebenezer. Ebenezer, Ebenezer, my stone of help, only you are my helper. Ebenezer, 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 Ebenezer. My stone of help, only you are my helper. Ebenezer, 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 my stone of help, only you are my help. When I call, you answer me. When I am down, yes, oh God. you lift me up. If my, my stone of hell, only you are. Take it again. When I was down, when I am down, you lift. Hey, when I call, you answer me. My stone of hell, only you are my. Heaven is high. Oh, heaven is high. Heaven is high. My soul of hell, only you are mine. Heaven is high. Heaven is high. Heaven is high. Heaven is high. My soul of hell, only you. One more time. Happiness, oh, happiness, my soul, my soul, of help, only you are my help. 
our helper. We thank you for hearing and answering our prayers. We believe by faith that you have answered us. And we thank you for it. Lord, for real, we shall come, stand in front of this same altar to give glory to your name in the presence of this congregation in Jesus' name. We thank you for healing, so God. We thank you for deliverances, O God. We thank you for restoration, O God. We thank you for the release of your power, O God. We thank you for miracles that have taken place in our lives. We thank you that you are moving us forward. We thank you for we are returning to give you thanks. Take all the glory. Take all the praise. Take all the worship. Take all the honor. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Put your hands to